Hi, good morning children. How are you? I hope you are all fine. Welcome to Nirbhaya High School, Padmanaga Phase 2, Chintan. Digital Learning Classes to understand the subject easily. I am your English teacher, Astralakshmi Ma'am. Hi children, good morning. How are you all? I hope everyone are fine. Yes children, yesterday what is we have completed? We have completed our module 9 formal writing. What is there in the formal writing children? About formal letter. Formal letter means what? We are writing the letter to the unknown person or a person who is in the authority. Yes children, now today's topic is creative writing. What is creative writing? In creative writing, we are having the story writing. Everyone know how to write a story. Yes, children. You know, everyone knows the story writing, children. Today's topic in the creative writing is... Yes, what is the story writing? What it is, children? Story writing. What is story writing? You can know, you know, everyone knows how to write a story also. Yes. Now, here, read the short story given below and complete the diagram. And diagram afterwards. Okay, children. It's fox, the rooster, and the dog. They have written a story. We will read now. One moonlight, moonlit night, a fox was going around a farmer's hand coop. He saw a rooster sitting high up behind his reach. Good news, good news, he cried. Why, what is that? said the rooster. King Lion has decided that no animal may hurt a bird from now onwards. And all shall live together in brotherly friendship. So why don't you come down here when we can have a nice long chat? Why, that is good news, said the rooster. And then I see someone coming with whom we can share this good news. And so saying, he turned his neck forward and looked for a f What is it you see? asked the fox. It's only my master's dog that is coming towards us. The fox began to turn away as soon as they heard the news. Will you not stop and congratulate the dog on the same news? I would gladly do so, said the fox. But I fear he may not have heard of King Lion's announcement and sped away as fast as lightning. The clever rooster had a heartly laugh and having outsmarted the cunning fox. See, how the cunning fox have done. Cunning fox was there. How the clever rooster was escaped from the cunning fox. This is the story here. Now, what is the title? The fox, the rooster and the dog. First, what you should be having, children? Title. You should be having the lesson of a story. You should have the first title. What is the title name, children? The fox, the rooster and the dog. After that, what you have to write? Setting. Where the setting was there, where the story was has done. Okay. After that, characters. What it should be there? Characters. What are the characters, children? Rooster, fox, dog. Setting was a farmhouse at the hen coop. And next, in a few short, simple sentences, you should write here the story. Here, a hungry fox sees a rooster sitting high up on a roof. He tries to trick the rooster into coming down by telling him a lie. The rooster sees through the fox trick. He plays a similar trick on the fox and the fox falls for it. This is a small simple sentence. Okay, children. This is the plot. And next, conclusion. The fox gets outsmarted by the rooster who uses wit and common sense of save himself. That is the conclusion. This is the story. It has things. Okay, children. Now, here we are having a... Exercise 5. What is the exercise 5? Look at the various elements of a story given below. Write a story using these elements. Give it a suitable title. By using these elements, you should write a title. See, uh, characters they have given. What are there? One boy, one girl, uh, two boys, one girl and one doggy is there. Setting, like it is like a forest. Important things. To be included in the plot. What is the important things included in the plot? A jewelry bar. A treasure it is. Okay. Okay children. See. Events. Children camping in a forest. Stories about treasure. Go looking for treasure in the forest. These are the events you should write. Now what is the title you can keep here? Yes tell me children. I can keep here title is the secret chest. The secret treasure chest. What it is children? The 
secret treasure chest this is the chest means what the box okay the secret treasure chest this is your title of the story now we are going to write a story title understood till story total story we have written the title now see write down everyone the secret treasure chest 42 page number children we are going to write now see here children page number 41 the fox was there, there is there no story writing see title the fox the rooster and the dog setting a farmhouse at the hen coop and what are the characters here a rooster a fox a dog and here plot in a few short simple sentences you should write a hungry fox sees a rooster sitting high up on a roof he tries to trick the rooster into coming down by telling him a lie the rooster sees through the fox's trick he plays a similar trick on the fox and the fox falls for it see your children once again here plot means what in a few short simple sentences you should write a hungry fox sees a rooster sitting high up on a roof he tries to trick the rooster into coming down by telling him a lie the rooster sees through the fox the rooster sees through the fox's trick he plays a similar trick on the fox and the fox falls for it and the conclusion children the fox gets outsmarted by the rooster who uses wit and common sense to save himself the fox gets outsmarted by the rooster who uses wit and common sense to save himself this is about the uh, story writing what we are there in, what we have read now the fox the, sto the rooster and the dog story title setting conclude character plot and the conclusion now we are going to write about exercise 5 children we are going to write exercise 5. Look at the various elements of a story given below. Write a story using these elements. Give it a suitable title. Characters, these are the settings, these are the important things to be included in the plot. Children camping in a forest, story about treasure, go look for, looking for the treasure in the forest. Now we are going to write this. Okay children, start writing. Exercise 5. The secret treasure chest. Write the names, your friend names also you can write. Lucky, Ramu and Danush. Where the three friends See here the three secret treasure chest Lucky Rahu and Danush were three friends who loved adventures who loved adventures along with Bruno Danush's dog they loved exploring new places nearby one weekend the four of them decided to go camping in the forest near Danush's house. The four of them were really excited. They always loved camping in the forest where they could light a cozy campfire. See your children. The secret treasure chest. Lucky Ramu and Danush. You can write your friends' names also. Were three friends who loved adventures along with the Bru Bruno Danush's dog. They loved exploring new places nearby. One weekend, the four of them decided to go camping in the forest near Danush's house. The four of them were really excited. They always loved camping in forests where they could light. Now see here. Light a cozy campfire. A cozy campfire. Sit around it, listening to each other's story. Bruno, Bruno would listen to. See, here. light a cozy campfire and sit around it, and sit around it, listening to each other's stories. Bruno would listen to. Wagging his tail as if he could actually understand them. Everyone can see no children? Yes. Next. That weekend, as they sat around the campfire, Bruno began to bark loudly. He ran towards an old banyan tree in the middle of the forest and began sniffing at the roots. The children followed him curiously. They decided to dig around and see what Bruno was sniffing at. 
Lucky ran to their tent and brought out a shovel. Together, the three of them took turns to dig with huffing and puffing. Suddenly, Dhanush dug deeper. The shovel hit hit something hard. With a lot of difficulty, the children pulled out what looked like a rusty old trunk, which was filled with something heavy. The children were really excited. The children were really excited. Who could, what could be possible inside the chest? Would they find treasure? Only one way to find out, said Ramu, as he took a large stone and broke the lock of the chest. The lock opened. Alas, there was no treasure inside. Instead, the children found some old books. More stories for tonight, said Lucky, excitedly, because she loved books. See your children once again. Till there we have learned no light, till right we have written a cozy campfire and sit around it, listening to each other's story. Bruno would listen too, wagging his tail as if he could actually understand them. That weekend as they sat around the campfire, Bruno began to bark loudly. He ran towards an old banyan tree in the middle of the forest and began sniffing at the roots. The children followed him curiously. They decided to dig around and see what Bruno was sniffing at. Lucky ran to their tent and brought out a shovel. Together, the three of them took turn to dig with huffing and puffing. Suddenly, the Danish dug deeper. The shovel hit something hard. With a lot of difficulty, the children pulled out what looked like a rusty old trunk, which was filled with something heavy. The children were really excited. Who could be? What could be possible inside the chest? Would they find treasure? Only one way to find out, said Ramu, as he took a large stone and broke the lock of the chest. The lock opened. Alas, there was no treasure inside. Instead, the children found some old books. More stories for tonight, said Lucky excitedly, because she loved books. So here, yeah, first this is. Completed children. Any doubts you can ask me in our live class. A cozy campfire. Complete children.